What's up everyone, Burial here, and guess what? Mighty number no. 9 is delayed. Uh, again. No! So, what does this mean for fans of this new potential series and hardcore Mega Man veterans? Well, the good news is that Keiji Inafune and his staff are hard at work correcting this most recent issue that they're having with Mighty Number no. 9, which, believe it or not, is networking at this point. That's right, these guys are having trouble doing online multiplayer for the primarily single player game. Now don't get me wrong, cooperative play versus and all the little modes that they're including for more than one player is going to be pretty awesome, but I don't understand why on a primarily single player focused game they're going to delay the release for the third time just to patch these issues before launch. Primarily, most of the people that want to play this game are going to play, you know, single player to get through the game and have a blast with it, and then are going to do the online features as a novelty to get more fun out of the game. But, at the same time, I kind of understand the mentality of it, they don't want to ship out a busted game. Either way, they are saying that we are looking at a spring 2016 release, so uh, that could be within the next upcoming months, could be all the way up until maybe April or May at the latest. Let's hope that we can get this little gem, from what I've seen so far, out as soon as possible. But, obviously that February 9th date is a lie, it's not cool at all, but that was just one of the most recent trailers coming out for it. Uh, but, just wanted to throw a quick little update on Mighty Number no. 9, and seeing how this wasn't going to be a very big video to begin with, this was more along the lines of collecting my thoughts to see exactly where this game is going to go, and hopefully not get any more future delays. Of course, just because this game is going to be delayed doesn't mean that it's going to be any less fun, especially since they're trying to work on these post-launch issues. But for the time being, go ahead and let me know what your thoughts are in the comments below. Thank you guys for tuning in, and of course, if you have any other questions, go ahead and direct them my way. We'll be covering this game as much as possible when it comes out, but for the time being, we're going to have to wait just to see exactly when this game is going to come out. It's a bummer, but... I'm going to stick with it. Hopefully it ends up being fun. But that is going to do it. Uh, I'm going to be signing off for this video. And thank you guys very much for tuning in.